If you would like a chance to win a vinyl sticker of today's art piece, comment below. I will be selecting a winner before my next review on Tuesday. Keep an eye open for shorts and comment responses to you as I will be notifying you in both those methods of the winner. Hello everyone and welcome to another time-lapse horror movie review with me, Angela, a morbid heart design. A while ago I did the original Predator and when I was deciding how I wanted to do that I really couldn't decide between a mask or no mask so I figured there are multiple movies, why not do both? So that's what I've done, I've done both and today we're gonna be talking about Predator from 2018. This might be a quicker review. I'm not sure. We'll see what happens. This movie is directed by Shane Black. It stars Boyd Holbrook, Travada Rhodes, Jacob Tremblay, um, some other names that I didn't really know. I felt like there was a lot in this cast that I kind of recognize, but I don't. Their names don't come to mind. Now, I did see this movie in theaters after watching the original before, and I'm really torn on this movie. I feel like it's one you do need to just go into stupid entertainment mode and just watch. It's definitely flawed from a movie making perspective, but it's a good BS experience to kill time, distract yourself from the world, not think about anything, mind numbing. I mean, the word, I could go on. I could go on, but I'm not. I think you get the point. But I will add really quick, don't expect much from this movie. Spoiler alert, not really. I'll say it in a way that's not a spoiler, but to prepare you, uh, the ending of this movie, like the last maybe five minutes at the most, completely destroyed this movie in my opinion. And I was like, what the fucking fuck? Really? You could have just stopped and I would have liked this movie more, but you had to go that much further and completely destroy it for me. Uh, it was, I'm annoyed now, still. I don't know if I wanna, I probably will never watch this movie again because of how annoying the ending was to me. And to support my point, I just wanna share with you, it did win Golden Schmoes Awards for biggest disappointment of the year. I think it did deserve that. It had so much potential and it reached the potential in some ways and then just decided we don't really want this. We're gonna fuck everything up. Some good things about the movie, not that I've really gone into a lot of the bad things, I guess that's like a huge bad thing. The ending of the blue movie ruins so much of the plot. Things that I do like about the movie. The stunt work was pretty fucking awesome. The makeup, of course, was on point because it's the Predator. There were funny moments, I did laugh. Those are the good things about the movie. Uh, for the time period, the budget, when this movie was made, I guess that goes under time period. The CG in this movie was extremely disappointing. Super disappointing. Like, I have no words on how disappointing it was. So, that's a thing. That's how I feel. I, I just... My brain's going numb just trying to think of what to say and going through my notes and how to phrase my notes. I'm just gonna call it quits here and give you my rating. I do rate this movie 2 out of 5 zombievers. I feel like it's been a really long time since I have picked anything that low that I've rated. I mean, I'm picking a lot of things that I'm excited to draw about and whatnot, so that could definitely be a factor. I'm picking a lot of really awesome fucking movies. I need to watch a little bit more terrible movies to throw in reviews here or there, I think. But that's a question for me for future that is not present me's problem to deal with. Present me's problem to deal with is not really a problem, but to end this video. I hope you've enjoyed the video, I hope you've enjoyed the art, I hope you've enjoyed my thoughts. I appreciate you watching. As always, I thank my patrons, cause you guys are fabulous. Fucking fabulous. I need to do like a theme song for you guys, maybe. Maybe that's what I'll do. But on that note, from my dark heart to yours, have a wonderful day, and please don't die before my next video.